Our goal is to seek the truth and find out what's happened to these people. So in February 2023, the Calgary Cold Case Unit, in collaboration with the RCMP, developed a hypothesis that eventually led to the closure of a case nearly 50 years old. Our investigators have dedicated countless hours laying their investigative genetic genealogy expertise to the RCMP, and we are very grateful to have played a part in finding answers for these families. Between 1976 and 1977, four young females were found deceased outside of Calgary. The initial investigations lasted through the 90s with countless task forces, officers, and re-examination of evidence until the year 2000. This new decade ushered in the advancement in DNA technology and links to this unsolved case. Officer Forsen adding, investigators are now applying this DNA tool to local cases, including homicide, sexual assaults, and recently started working with the Office of the Chief Medical Examiner to identify unidentified remains. Unfortunately, throughout the history of the Calgary Police Service, we have about 114 unsolved homicide files, and we have our historic homicide team supported by civilian uh, specialists and analysts reviewing the files, and we're always looking at um, are there viable samples? As an indicator of investigative progress, this 1976 Calgary Herald article quoting a police officer on this case saying, we haven't a clue how the girls met their deaths. 50 years later, and through DNA advancements, those Calgary families finally have their answer. In Calgary, Phoenix Phillips, City News.